What's up guys, Captain Xface here with some more Call of Duty gameplay. Using the Leatherface Chainsaw right here is a light machine gun. It's uh <laughs> has a laser sight and what well, I'm using what am I using here? Rapid fire and uh that barrel, I think it's like something muzzle. It uh it increases the range and uh I think a little bit of damage too. Just makes it a better gun overall. And and this guy right here takes more shots to the face. And Sasha Gray, I, I don't know why he didn't die. And uh, the the connections, like uh, the hit detection, is really good on this. But sometimes it just get in the game, and I play with spread a lot, so um, we're 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 a couple states in between, like away from each other. So uh, we've we've had games where I've done good, he's done bad, and he's complaining about the connection a little bit. And uh, the map starts shaking, like Michael J. Fox right there. And that that happened a couple times, I think. It's Tremor. I, I like uh, I like Tremor though. I think it's a one of the better maps, one of my favorite maps in the game. So far, I, I would put it in my top three. I like Tremor is really nice. Octane Octane is really fun. Um, Warhawk I think is the best. Although Tremor is up there with it, I think in my opinion. And let me pop that dude's head right there. He's trying to head glitch me and then unfortunate death right there. But it's all good. I ended up having a pretty nice game. And uh what is a uh, and fright. I like fright a lot too. As long as you don't get guys that, that camp a lot, that, that map is really fun, but it can be ruined. And you see this thing just shreds, man. I mean look at this. This this almost it feels like a death machine, kinda. Uh just the way you fire it. It's kinda the same thing where you aim in and the the reticle or what is it, the crosshairs get a little tighter. So you can I have steady aim on it as well. Uh, I'll, I'll tell you my perks. I have ready up, sleight of hand, marathon, steady aim, dead silence, ping, and uh, I'm still using the same support streaks I've always used so far in the game. Is uh, the satcom, ballistic vest, and oracle. Just because, like I said, I'm, I'm not very good at the game yet, so I haven't delved into soul kill streaks. And really, I only bought ballistic vests as a, as a kill streak so far. Because I've just been trying, I've been wanting to try different guns and different attachments and different perks. So I really haven't spent much time getting kill streaks because kill streaks aren't aren't that great in this game. But but I like it. It's more gun on gun action. But uh, I was talking about the connection earlier. Uh, the connection could get a little funky sometimes, but for the most part, you know, you might for every two bad games, weird games you have, and I, I sound horrible. This guy right here, I heard him coming. And uh, right here, I'm just trying to get a kill with uh with you know with the prone to get the field orders. Field orders are awesome. So I gotta drag my dick and gravel a little bit here <laughs> for a little bit till I can get that. But the connection, like for every ten good games you have, you have two bad games. Uh, that will probably disappear once dedicated servers uh can go up if they ever go up, which they said they would. Uh, when before the game said came out, they said there would be dedicated servers. So here I put my my vest on, and ballistic vests are crucial in this game. I think uh, they they almost double your health it seems sometimes unless you get hit with like a shotgun or a sniper. And uh, I heard that guy again and do a little nice little jump shot. But that spot right up here I'm in, this is a really really nice spot to get up in. Uh, I don't want to encourage it too much because uh, I did get a little campy here, which I, I don't like. But I mean there was a lot of traffic coming on both sides. And uh, it was pretty easy to get some kills and kill streaks going there. But yeah, the connection, like the hit detection is great, but I think it, everything that people, and you see right there, it has pretty good range. The connection will clear up and be way more consistent, I think, with dedicated servers to go up online. So there we go. And you see, I mean, I'm just shredding right now with this thing. I just keep going back and forth. So uh, I'm really area patrolling, but uh, it, it's, it's a little campy. Play, playing very conservative, really easy to, to get kills on that spot. But so far, this is my—I think this is my favorite gun. Uh, the shotgun FP6 was really good. I really enjoyed that gun. I, I still use it a lot. Uh, spread has really come accustomed to it. If you watched the last the dual com I did with him, which sure will be up. I'll put a link at the end of the video. And uh, look at look at spread. I think he's running around with it right there, actually. Now I get the Oracle and check this out. I don't know how I got this kill. This guy. Uh, I got the benefit of. Um, maybe some connection right there. So he didn't kill me as quick as I usually get killed. And I, I got some shots on him. It looked like I got a couple shots from around the corner. So and that guy just gets dropped and this guy just drops me. I think that was a burst gun. Which is uh... Burst gun is probably the, the only overpowered weapon I've noticed so far. But uh, I mean it's not 
no one's overusing it really. You'll get like maybe one guy in a game with it. Uh, it's not like FAMAS was in, in Black Ops 1 or Type 95 or in ACR were in Modern Warfare 3. So right now it's not bad. And uh, I'm enjoying the hell out of this game so far. It is, it is great. So great. I get voice cracks if you pick that up. But uh, my my uh, my um my aim really sucks in this game at, at times. Uh, I, I still don't got my shot back, and there I put a sentry gun. It's also a nice spot for a sentry gun. And check this out, this guy just pauses. Like, oh fuck me! <laughs> he just pauses like, oh fuck me! And I just take him out. And uh, I take this guy out, I think. No, no, he gets me. All right, I, I could I lost track of him. If that was the same guy, I wasn't even I wasn't even sure if that was the same guy or not. But yeah, definitely try this gun out if you have some points to spare. It is nine points in the, uh, the light machine guns. It's the only one I've tried out, but so far it's my favorite gun in the game. Uh, don't put a silencer on it. Uh, I, I tried that, and um, it, it's, it's a death laser from close range. But you want this barrel on, and maybe off the grid. And Michael J. Fox with Parkinson's acting up again right here. But you want the barrel. And well, look right here, I had a triple kill opportunity. I almost died right there. That's what I mean by my aim sucking. I, I should have just just killed them right there. And there you have the end of the game, 25 and 6. Only 12 tags, but I did get a little campy at the end in, in the field orders. Where I had to drag my dick in gravel to get a sentry gun. But it was worth it, because you see right here, this guy just tries to run across the Normandy beach. And he gets <laughs> lit up right there. That's what it is. Look at that barren wasteland, just Normandy beach. So there you have it, guys. If you guys like the video, just uh, drop a like. And uh, you can check out more videos. And until next time, guys, stay tuned. Legend. Legend.